we have made this release available for BC14 and newer versions, meaning that uh, DOM Capture 2022 release one is not available for versions older than BC14 or NAV 2018 fall is also known as. But we will be supporting the older versions of BC Central with service packs for the previous releases of DOM and Capture. So don't worry, you can still work with the older versions and update um, uh, the next mini month. In our news release, we also did a few performance updates here and there. It was mainly in the document handling area that we uh, speeded up the, the code. And as we usually do, we have also this time added several events, make it possible for you to customize the solution according to the demands. And to make the new features work in the web portal portal, we of course also updated that program code. Looking at the improvements for country and localization, we have uh, Finland and Poland added as full localization to the solution, both on premises and online installations, whereas Faroe Islands and Greenland is now available in PC online only, uh, but still, uh, you would say for new uh, country localizations available for Dogma Capture. I'll jump over the US uh, app. Uh, item and return to it later. I will dive deeper into many of these items on today's, today's agenda um, with either a detailed PowerPoint or a um, hands on live demonstration. And the list of general application uh, feature uh, we added is it's long. And one of the things that we did, minor thing, but uh, very important to know that we change the name of the navigate action um, in the document card to find entries in order to make sure that you have the right naming and you know that this was changed if you cannot find the navigate action it is of course it has been renamed to find entries um, to match the the naming in pc central modern versions we also enhance the user experience like um, simplified uh, the city setup a bit. We updated some page captions and layout and also uh, created easy access to several functions and sub pages. Looking at the document approval list, we have three items that we need to go through. I will return to them later today. And if we fast forward through the document and template area, we have here uh, one very important area, the configurable messages, the comments that you have in your journal. We can now um, modify 30 new messages or more messages, uh, enabling you to um, configure either the message as a information, warning, or an error, and through that automate the assigning of documents to, to colleagues in, in the companies. Or have the Dumber Capture uh, automatic process and complete the documents or make them stop if you want some messages to, to block the automated processes, of course. Looking at the XML area, we have added two new XML formats that we support. One is the German Sukfat version one, and the other one is an Australian New Zealand table format that is now fully supported in uh, Dharma Capture. Let's um, look at some of the other uh, items on the list that I didn't mention, going a bit deeper into uh, these areas. And let's start out with the US app 